All right, now let's go over a math trick. So for this math trick, we use this for uh, some algebraic uh, questions. So if there is an algebraic expression and there's no way to find out exactly what x is, and the answers are also uh, algebraic expressions, we can just pick numbers. So here we have x squared minus x minus 2 over x plus 1. And it wants us to evaluate this or uh, simplify it to find uh, a similar expression or an equivalent expression. All right, so we can do this algebraically, but we're going to go over this with a trick. So the trick is we're just going to pick a number for x, okay? And then you want to avoid picking 0, 1, and 2. Okay, so I recommend picking 3 for x. Okay, and the reason why we, pick, we eliminate picking 0 is because uh, uh, one thing is that if uh, you have 0 times something, it's going to go away. Right, or if it's one, a lot of times it's inconsequential, like it's something times one remains the same. And then uh, don't pick two because uh, the, the makers of these tests know that people pick numbers, so they'll make uh, different answer choices work if you pick two, even though they're not the correct answer. So we're gonna pick three. So we're gonna put three in for the x value, so we get uh, three squared minus three minus two over 3 plus 1. And let's see what we get. So 3 squared, that's 9, minus 3 minus 2, over 3 plus 1 is 4. So 9 minus 3 is 6, then minus 2 is 4, so we get 4 over 4, which is 1. So if one of these is equivalent to this, it should also equal 1 when x is 3. So if we look at this one, it's x minus 3, should be 3 minus 3, which is 0, so that's not the same as 1. Let's try this one. We have x minus 2, so that would be 3 minus 2. And that does equal 1, which is what this equals when x is 3. So that means that uh, choice B is going to be the answer. So again, uh, we're just going to pick a number for the variable, uh, put it into the, the equation or into the expression, Find out what it equals when x is 3 or when the number is 3. And then check the answer choices to see which one also gives us that same value.